can't be a Florian and not have health. Whoa! <laughs> hey, uh, a part of me overdrawed him. Oh my goodness. You gotta, be, you gotta be careful now. You, you scared me. You freaking scared me. Welcome to another edition of The Bay. Casey Phillips here with Jamel Don't Make a Scene Dean, who I would now also like to call New Deal Dean. New Deal Dean? New Deal I like the name. Dean. You like it? You feel it? I like it? it, I like it. And because now we are all so excited, you're going to continue to be here with us and continue to be in Florida, we felt like we'd bring you to the most Florida thing, which is putt-putt. Put put. Yes, the Trying self Florida. My skills. So how are you at this? Are you an expert? Uh, no, I'm not an expert, <laughs> but I just like to do different things. Okay. You know, to make myself feel good. Yeah. Oh, so you're assuming you're gonna win based on the fact that you're gonna feel good? Yeah. Wow. I trust my ability. Already, I feel Pretty like the stick. trash talk has already begun. All right, Pretty well, stick. let's see if you can back it up. Let's do it. So how do you even keep score? So it's just like golf, where you count the number of strokes on each hole. Part two. I get two tries. Oh, we got the practice swing. He's so serious. Warm up. Oh boy, we got the speed. Oh my <laughs> goodness. Too hard. That too hard. was too hard. so close. That was wild. Is it fair to say you were a competitive person? Uh, sometimes. Sometimes. Where would you rank on the team in competitiveness? Uh, I'm up there in the broad patch. You're up you know, there. In I'm up there in the broad patch. patch. Like if it's a friendly game, you know I'll. I'm not too competitive. Yeah. But it just, I like to be able to like, at least look good doing it. But you know, but competing wise, yes, yeah, I'm very competitive like during the season. Yeah. No, no, no way I missed this, right? Why? No way I missed this. It's, we're too close. That's a big, big game you're talking right now. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, Putt Putt will humble you real quick. I'm trying to tell you. Putt Putt will humble you. Oh. oh. Huh. Oh Welcome to the cave. A cave hole. At least it's nice and cool in here. Do you have you done any other sports as like hobbies outside of football? Uh, growing up. Yeah. Uh, I did. I was mainly a football and track guy. Track guy, yeah. So, Cause you speedy. What's your What's your peak distance? If you were just gonna enter one race, what would be your best one? Uh, I'm definitely doing a hundred. Hundred? Yeah, That's definitely a hundred. Dang. On the team, would you have the, the fastest hundred? Yes, I keep telling. I'm the, I'm, I'm the fastest on You're the, the team. fastest on the team. Fastest on the team. Don't you make know, a scene. I showed my speed when we played Pittsburgh that one time. I had to ran the guy down. Following blockers to the 40, to the 50. It's a foot race to the 35, 30. It is Sims all tackled at the 13 yard line. That's true. You did. Kind of shot myself in the foot. <laughs> Holding one. No way! What a recovery! I feel like this is this the mental toughness that Coach yeah. Bowles taught you. This is Always. what it is. <laughs> you you owe this hole in one to Coach Bowles. What is the ways that you've changed mentally about the game since you were a rookie? Now that you're on your, your uh, second deal. I kind of like recognize. I'm able to recognize formations. I understand situations. Situational football now. Yeah. So you know, back in back in uh, you know rookie year. Oh no! Oh, it's going in the water. Oh. <laughs> The thing is, the, the sign says caution. Slippery when wet. Be you careful. Did. My golf game is a little slippery when whatever. This is terrible. Wah, wah, wah. You got a hole in one and I went in the water. This is just embarrassing. Give me the, the way that Bowles would tell me to approach this mentally. Yeah, we got a long game ahead of us. Mm. Just gotta keep gotta keep playing. Mm. <laughs> oh. That's tough as nails right there. What do you feel like was the main emotion you felt when you signed your new contract? You know, my main emotion was like, like, in, like still in shock. I like no way this. I like no way this is real. Yeah. Hey, I, did I just really just get another four years with the Bucks? <laughs> and then I like, still haven't dawned. It still haven't dawned on me yet. I think like once like I, I probably check my bank account, then I'm like, yeah, it, <laughs> this is it actually happened. So what's the first big purchase? I'm gonna buy me a house and I told myself I'm gonna make sure my mom and dad are straight. That's awesome. Are you gonna get them a house you mean or is it just other things? Well, yeah, I'm gonna get my mom a house yeah. and then my dad wants a trailer. <laughs> That's great. Country boy. Part two. <laughs> part two. I feel like you say part two the way it's like parkour. What a shot. What a shot. 
I think I've been hustled. I, if we were playing for money, I'd be like very suspicious of you right now. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> You're the worst. <laughs> oh. I was so worried about the water, I barely tapped it. I think the water just uh it's an illusion. Alright. That looks so uncomfortable. No! Uh -oh. No! Alright. I don't think we need to add this up. Pretty nah. sure nobody needs to know. I don't think uh, anybody can just maybe find a trash can for <laughs> this little uh, squishy. Not important. Yeah. But I have exciting news for you. What's the news? You get to hold an alligator. Really? <laughs> Let's go for it. <laughs> that was such a range of emotions. I, ah! I got a little dude for you. I'm glad you got his mouth safe. Yeah. So yeah. this is Brogu. Uh, he's Brogu? He's a year old North American alligator. I never touched an alligator before. Yeah. yeah so oh my gosh. Are you friendly? <laughs> yeah, he's pretty chill. He's just hanging out. Yeah, so you're just gonna put one hand underneath his tail and one hand over his front arm right there for you. Look at this. Now you're a true Florida man. I know, right? <laughs> Can't be a Florida and not have health. Whoa! <laughs> hey, a part of me almost dropped him. If he wiggles, don't worry about oh it. Oh my goodness. Oh, you, gotta be, you gotta be careful now. You, you scared me. You freaking scared me. Where's your mom? <laughs> That's what, I'm, that's what I'm scared of. So what I learned today is that you are freakishly good at putt-putt, and I think that you've been lying to me about how often you do this. I haven't been lying. That's honestly my first time ever put, doing putt-putt golf. That makes it so much worse. Beginner's luck. It did make me feel better that you were a little afraid of the alligator. That was, that was helpful for me. <laughs> that right after we finished, that I got to watch a little bit of terror go across your face, and then especially when it was like the world's tiniest alligator. I know, right? But <laughs> I'm glad he had his mouth taped. What's worse? An alligator or like a giant tackle coming to just like crush you? Uh, probably the alligator. Yeah, <laughs> it's probably a good bet. At least you won't have to face one of those this season. It's yeah, I know, right? Mm -hmm.